Good evening. This is Paul from What Plant Is That Paul? And tonight we're going to talk about um, mealy bugs and new growth on bamboo. So I like to take a look at the new shoots here. And so I took a few minutes and this one I pulled this piece down. Everything seemed fine. And then I started, I like to sit and watch the ants. And if I notice an ant trail, which I did on this one, um, I like to follow them and then you can see right here those are the mealy bugs see them those little pink things and the ants like to protect them and harvest their whatever they secrete so I believe these are the noxious mealy bugs I'm not sure but either way they are very bad for bamboo so let's see if I can find some more I'll come up here and let's take a look so again look at that it's much worse See all the ants? You can see the mealy bugs right in there. See them? I'll zoom in for you. There you go. So those are impossible to treat because you can see they're under the new growth. You can see the, how disgusting they are and what the ants kind of do to protect them. So the only way to really treat this is going to be using a systemic. So let's pull this one down too just to see. Again, pulling it out here, you can see the mealy bug right there. See it? So super annoying, just like this focus. There we go. And so there's the little mealy bug, and it's just horrible. So what you need to do to treat them is use bear tree and shrub. So this is what I use. I follow the directions. I mix it into a bucket with water, and um, then I pour it directly onto the base of the bamboo. So I only do it on the infected ones because this stuff is what kills the bees. So you definitely want to use it carefully. I never use it on anything flowering. Um, and the reason why I think it's okay on the bamboo is because bamboo only flowers once every 75 years or so. So um, bees never really go on this plant. So we should be good. So I'm going to go ahead and treat that and I'll show you what it looks like in a second. Okay, so here it is. I mixed it up as directed. And then I like to pour it directly onto the new shoots um, and then make sure it kind of goes onto the roots really well. So if I had more time, I probably should have raked it out better, but this is gonna work today. It should be fine. So this is about all that I do. And it's very, very green in color. Just kind of make sure, and especially the one that has uh, the bugs infested on it, I like to just make sure I get around the soil really well. That's about it. Not much to it. And usually one treatment should be plenty for taking care of the mealy bugs. So there you go. Give us a like and a subscribe. That's how we treat the bamboo mealy bug or the noxious mealy bug. And it seems to work really well. All right, take care. Dude, it's creepy.